Okay. These people are after everything I own. My company, my land, everything I own. I own an account. Some Nigerian woman. Nigerian woman with tracheal cancer. Gave me $800,000 in Nigeria so I can buy a house for me and my son. $800,000. After that, she died. And her family came to America to steal the $800,000 from me. They stole $300,000 out of the account, leaving me with $500,000. And now they and all of my friends are working to try and get that $500,000 for them. What they don't know is that the accountant on the account advertised to everybody in Nigeria that if they didn't want their money getting taken by their family or somebody, that they can donate it to the First Temple of Bob Boblian Ministries at that account. So now there are millions of dollars in that account. But all these people are worried about is 500000 because they think it's just 500000 And they're not going to leave me alone until they get that $500,000. But what they don't know is I have more than $500,000 in the account because I took their accountant off of the account and put the Scottish treasurer on it instead. So they have no access to the account anymore and they need me to give them $500,000. Only I don't have $500,000 without taking it out of that account and I'm not transferring any money from that account to America. So I'm living broken, miserable because these people are trying to steal from me. My family, friends, and the Nigerians. If the Nigerians hadn't showed up, they wouldn't be stealing from me as bad. You understand? They want that $500,000. And they will not shut up about $500,000. The Pope, Pope Francis of the Vatican, sent me a cash check. A, cash made out, a check made out to cash for $100 million. Marge Stafford stole it out of my mailbox and gave it away. Then everybody started talking about how they wanted $100 million out of me. Why is it every time I have money, you want money? If you want money, go out and earn it for a living. Go out and get a job. You understand? You know what you do? You do something and you get paid for it. That's what I'm doing. An online broadcast with which I get paid for it. By Pepsi Cola Pepsi products. Sold in stores near you. For since a simple thing is showing a Pepsi bottle and mentioning Pepsi products sold at stores near you, I have made a million dollars in broadcast money. Because I advertise Pepsi Cola Pepsi products here on my live feed, Pepsi Cola pays me a million dollars to do this. Monster Energy Drinks, also on sale at stores near you, paid me $100,000 to advertise for them. Shasta Cola, affordable cola, the cool cola flavor at an affordable price, paid me $10,000 to advertise, or $20,000 to advertise for them. So, get a YouTube broadcast. Get companies to pay you to broadcast their items on your broadcast, and you will make money, good money. You just need followers. So, fuck you. Get off your ass, get a damn job, and make some fucking money yourself. Because I'm not Mr. Moneybags giving it to you. Just because somebody gave me money, doesn't mean I have to give all my family and friends money. I don't owe the Nigerians anything. That woman gave me $800,000. She didn't say you can have it if you do something. She said take it and buy yourself a house. Because I don't want my family to have it. And I understand where they're coming from. Because the money, I don't want my family to have it. I'll give it to the Vatican. And with that, I'll go.